The quest to see as many as possible of Japan's snowy winter festivals takes us from Aomori, where we saw the Motsuke festival, to here, Hirosaki. The Hirosaki castle has another very beautiful winter festival. And once again, so that you can see where actually Hirosaki is, compared to Tokyo, just under Hokkaido Island. Welcome to Hirosaki. They have a castle, and then they have also something like Nebuta. So this is what we get to see here at the station. And uh, look, we are trying this Hirosaki, traditional cookies. See how nice it's made by hand, each of them, wow. And then they will be grilled on the side here. Wow, amazing. And this is how it's served in this very cool paper. I almost dropped it. Ja, it's in here. Yay, arrived at Hirosaki and already trying the local food. Let's see how it is. Oh, oh, oh. Mm. Very sweet, really delicious. Oh my god, really delicious. It's like a biscuit, but then it has these beans inside. So it's sweet and there is some saltiness to it. And the very familiar taste of biscuit, but then the unfamiliar taste of beans. So I totally recommend it. And wow, only in Japan, look, tourist information center. Look what they have here. They have rain boots that you can rent. <laughs> because it's bloody snowing. So if you didn't bring the right shoes, you can rent them here. Mm. Panty shot, cute girl. Pink. Welcome to Hirosaki. To white Hirosaki. <laughs> Really delicious, this bean stuff. So much snow, this poor tree here might crash down and look at the ice. Snow, snow. And this is our ryokan. Isn't it pretty, really traditional? Kobori. In Hirosaki, I'm staying at Kobori ryokan. Traditional Japanese style, how cute this is. You have a heater here, then you have hot water already for you. And down here you can prepare tea. And then there is a, always in such places a, something sweet, something to eat. So beautiful look and with here with a folded tsuru. And then, of course, TV and uh, tissue papers, towels, and you have a yukata. Uh -huh. Here you can store some items and a big mirror. <laughs> Look how red I am from the walking in the snow outside is really such a huge snow. And then you have this cute veranda where you can dry your towel and panties and have some view to the snow outside. <laughs> Look at this. Imagine two days ago there was no snow, so this is only for me. And then shower, toilet, everything you need. <laughs> so yeah, two days ago there was no snow basically. And you're gonna sleep here on the uh, tatami. And there are enough plugs, so everything's perfect. Two like air conditioner there and heater. And you get this set, a towel that you can take home with the name of the ryokan and a toothbrush with toothpaste inside. And then you can have breakfast here. I think it's something like six or seven US dollars I didn't have time for. But yeah, they even have this. And it's really cool. See, this is the tsuru, that amazing Japanese red crested crane and really traditional style like this. 
So it's one of the really traditional, few left traditional ah, ryokans. And here we have a wonderful example of Hinamatsuri dolls at the ryokan where I'm staying. So this is the queen and the king or the samurai and his wife. And then you have all the court dolls and then with sweets so that they can enjoy the sweets next to them here, the sweet cookies, but kind of like just sweet sugar, so not so delicious. And then you have the wise men and even they, they have their dishes here, very beautiful made, the uh, musicians of the court. And so the entire <laughs> court is here for the Hinamatsuri. And then even, you know, such uh, gifts and furniture. <laughs> wow. Really lovely. And see how the locals deal with snow here. There are all these vents where you can dump it underground and it's gonna melt in there and now look at this beautifully scraped street here for us walk and it's done with this mini two thing oh nice honda the snow machine amazing yay we get to see how it works And there's of course him. <laughs> but see these vents here? So each house can dump. There's no inside there. See like here also. It's been dumped in the and so it becomes a subterranean river. <laughs> Smart though another way to get rid of the snow so it's gonna be scooped from here from the main road and dumped there in the river and that's also very helpful so cool how these people have so many ways to deal with the snow famous apples of Tsugaru but they are really expensive four dollars for one to see the Tsugaru Ringo, <laughs> the apples of Tsugaru in front of the museum. Since I didn't yeah. get the apple yeah. of Hirosaki, we get at least the juice. Yeah.